Hey you guys, happy quarantine day 376. Welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, I'm Jenny. I like to review things to make sure you're not wasting your money or wasting your time. Today's video is a very popular one that I've been seeing on YouTube and TikTok for quite a while. I buy everything on Amazon, literally everything. Why go anywhere at all when you can buy it on Amazon? You can buy vitamins on Amazon. You can buy tampons on Amazon. You can buy groceries on Amazon. So before we get into my list of top things that I've bought on Amazon, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified whenever I post a new video. Okay, so I have my list here. First thing that's not actually on the list is my laptop case and most of these stickers that are on it. I will link them. These are not on my list. My laptop is really cool and I get a lot of questions about it. As always, everything will be linked below. And if you do purchase through my link, please know that I will get a commission. I don't mind if you do or if you don't. First thing on my list is a radio adapter. So if you have an old car and you want Bluetooth, get this. So what this radio adapter does is that if you have an old car, you can plug it into the, um, that little thing that people use to light their cigarettes. The car power outlet. Basically you put it in there. So you will pick a radio station with static electricity where you don't hear anything. And then you will program the machine to be on that same radio station. And then you connect Bluetooth to the little thing. It'll give you a name. It's funny because every time you connect, it says waiting for pairing, but it sounds like it says waiting for Perry. We think it's funny. We always joke about it. We're always like, who's Perry? We'll play the music that you put on your Bluetooth right here. Um, I can't really record and play music at the same time, but there you go. That's how you do it. It's really cool. I'm sorry my car is so dirty. I literally haven't driven it in like a month. You can play anything onto a radio, which is super cool if you have an old car. And I did. I had a Kia Optima 2003 for a very, very, very long time. Honestly, the only thing that got me through those days besides Boys Like Girls and Katy Perry CDs. The next thing is my ring light, which I'm using right now. It is amazing. It is the best thing ever. I used to have the box lights. They're huge. They take up so much space. They're so annoying to set up. And yes, they're more professional and they give more light, but I'm lazy. I'm a Taurus. I'm naturally super lazy. If there's an easy way out, I'm gonna take it. And this ring light is the easy way out. My ring light came with a stand. It extends, it even has a stick that allows you to turn the ring light or curve it if you wanna do different kinds of videos. I usually use it straight up and it came with the plastic cover that goes on the light. The diffuser, I think is what it's called. I'm not a videographer. So you have the white one and then you have the orange one, which makes like a natural kind of sunlight vibe. And I always used the white one. Ever since I started using the orange one, I am obsessed. If you're looking into starting videos or just taking cute pictures, it's perfect. It also came with a Bluetooth remote that you can connect to your phone or to your Canon camera. And it actually works and you can just click and take pictures and click record. Amazing, life-changing, spectacular, extraordinary. The next thing is really cool crazy it's actually something that i saw on twitter and i believe it was a snapchat video of someone who was sick and tired of washing their clothes in the dorm room laundry that they ended up buying a portable mini washer and dryer as a joke and then it turned out to be awesome it was like less than a hundred dollars so i was like yo in my building i have to pay a dollar fifty for the washer and then another dollar fifty for the dryer and not a lot fits in either or of them and the dryers suck they don't dry anything i bought the mini washer and dryer. Honestly, if you live in an apartment and you're in the same situation, it's too expensive, they're ripping you off, so worth it. 100% worth it. And we now have a dryer rack mounted onto the wall that you just pull out and then you hang all your clothes there and let it dry overnight. The little dryer, what it does is it rinses out most of the water, but it's still a little damp, so you just hang it. I thought that it would make the water bill go up or something like that, but you literally don't even use that much water because it's so powerful, dude. It cleans my clothes so well. I can wash every single day. I can wash the underwears, everything, every single day. If I want to, I don't, but if I want to, I can't. I decided that I wanted to actually bullet journal, but I hate the bullet journal planning, like making it a planner aspect. I kind of want to make it like a scrap journal, like a junk journal, but I wanted it to have structure and a purpose. So I chose 
to make my bullet journal which is inspired by journal with chloe or journal by chloe i will link her channel right here she's so beautiful and i'm so inspired by everything she does she's just like really cool i was inspired by her to do a movie reading bullet journal in one i searched all over amazon and amazon reviews to find the perfect bullet journal and i ended up choosing this one i don't know the name of it i will link it below because it literally has nothing it's like plain tbr I have my favorite books of all time favorite tv shows favorite movies less space for some new movies everything i watched in february with like reviews and stuff and these are the two books that i read in february i have everything next to me because i am lazy i bought an hp sprocket on amazon with a case separate this is case was six dollars i will link everything down below the case and all i got the red one because for some reason it was cheaper i guess nobody likes red but i got the red hp sprocket and this is a inkless printer all you have to do is buy the little papers which come out way cheaper than a polaroid so much cheaper than a polaroid because i do have an instax mini polaroid and i refuse to use it because i refuse to pay for the paper the paper for this one comes with 20 papers in a pack 20 sheets in a pack and they're like 10 bucks and they already have sticky backs so they're perfect for bullet journaling perfect and ever since i got this so many people ask me to use it and the best part is that you don't have to change any ink i don't know how it does it i don't know the science behind it but this is a inkless printer put it in its little case here with its little charger and the first picture i printed was a picture of me and my boyfriend on one of our first dates we went to animal kingdom when i worked there but it's perfect it literally fits in my backpack i carry it with me when i want to like i don't know bullet journal in a coffee shop or something which i've done not now obviously i'm inside but before so the next thing i got that was like completely life-changing is this nightstand that's next to my bed and i bought it as an amazon deal of the day for 35 dollars. i thought it was gonna be so tiny i thought it was gonna be so um shitty for lack of a better word but it's good it has a very large top and i can also store books in the bottom which is very important to me i wanted something that had a little bit more storage the one thing i will complain about is the drawer it sucks it doesn't even go in all the way i don't understand it was i guess it was poorly made and that's why it was like a deal of the day whatever it's something that i can live with it doesn't bother me that much I just don't try to open it that much before i was using this stool back here as a nightstand a stool so i could barely even put my phone on it without knocking like a cup of water off of the freaking stool so having a nightstand chef's kiss if i can find it i can't promise that it's still 35 dollars because it was an amazon deal of the day i bought a car mount it was a little bit more pricier than other car mounts but not too much i'm not using it right now obviously because we're not going anywhere but when i was driving to work i would drive to work like about 35 miles usually takes 45 minutes to an hour i can easily access my phone to play my audiobooks or pick a new podcast or pick a new song and i could vlog but yeah you can move it up and down tighten it and yeah i like that it sticks to the dashboard and not the mirror because i hate things on my mirror and this is very good support for your phone how you move these little things no facetime you're watching netflix while driving no 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 every time someone sees it they're like that's so dangerous why are you watching netflix while, dri while driving i'm like why are you assuming that i'm watching netflix while driving that's so stupid i literally use it to vlog or to pick a song All right, so the amount that actually came on my ring light for the phone sucked so i bought a separate one that was less than ten dollars and it is amazing i was one of those people who wanted that really cute like acrylic earring holders or like the ones that you put on the wall and then you can hang all your earrings on the wall or like hang them off of little hooks on the wall but i ended up going with this instead which a lot of people don't talk about it's an earring book you just put earrings in there they're so cute 12 earrings on each page and you have four pages the only thing that i have to say about this is that you have to obviously space out your bigger earrings with your smaller earrings in between not too many big earrings on one page because they'll just fall out so that looks super cute on my desk i kind of don't want to say this because i got a lot of hate for the monet video for so for not supporting an mlm for buying from an mlm i started drinking herbalife shakes basically i bought what is is called a pop baby's blender it's not here unfortunately i left it at my office we are on full lockdown so we're not allowed to grab anything that we left behind in the office i was blending my protein shakes by hand shaking them with a little shaker ball inside the 
little water bottle thing. I bought this little blender called the Pop Babies and they're just so cute. I love them. And it comes with a little tiny mini cube ice tray because it can only take small things. So if you're going to make like a fruit smoothie in it, you have to cut it up in little cubes and you have to put the little cubes of ice. It's so cute. It's adorable. And it's good for one size serving if you want to make smoothies or shakes, protein shakes, whatever on the go at work. Oh, it's USB. You can do it in the car. I love my Pop Babies blender. It's literally one of the best things I've ever bought. When I was fixing my room along with the earrings thing, I just was looking for ways to organize things that didn't look put together. And I found these purse hangers. It's like a big strap that has all these loops that you could just Velcro in your purses. And I have so many purses, it's ridiculous. Literally two of those straps in my closet all the way in the back with all my purses hanging on it, so convenient. It's like my purses are not even there because they overlap. It's like one big giant fur coat taking one space. And it does reach all the way to the bottom floor. There are purses that do touch the ground. I don't know if that bothers anyone, for me personally, I put my like already destroyed, used too much, already messed up purses at the bottom. I didn't hang backpacks on there. Backpacks I put into the back of my closet and then all my purses are perfectly hanging and lined up. Amazing, save so much space. I had all my purses hanging on the back of the door and I couldn't even open my door all the way. It might be TMI, I don't know. I bought a pack of 20 black thongs from Amazon and they turned out to be the most comfortable underwear and I used them all the time it kind of may look like i wear the same underwear for 20 days straight because i always wear them but they're worth it that's it that's all you gotta know and they are affordable no more underwears from victoria's secret that break in five seconds also lace is really bad for you this is for all my peeps that follow me because i did um my whole teeth journey teeth whitening teeth straightening my entire teeth journey after i got my deep cleaning i ended up purchasing a water pick dental flosser and i'm not gonna turn it on because it is powerful this is it you fill it with water and then you press the button i'm not gonna press it because it literally <laughs> when i first turned it on it just like sprayed the whole room it's really strong so you press the button and then you just run it through your teeth and it's a water flosser like it has a normal setting soft setting and a pulse setting and the pulse setting is crazy i wouldn't suggest it if you have sensitive gums next we have my amazing beautiful wonderful passion planner in which i did put some hp sprocket pictures here i have johnny depp and lil peep this is the best planner ever made um, you can buy it on Amazon or you can buy it directly from passionplanner.com. This one was gifted to me by my sister, but the first one that we ever purchased about three or four years ago, that's how much we love the Passion Planner, we're still using it, was from Amazon. So the reason I love this planner is because it's kind of like a gratitude planner that helps you work towards your goals. You create a passion plan. I don't want to show you what I wrote in the other page, but this is like you create a passion plan. Do a roadmap again in the middle of the year. So you just like set out your goals and then pick your main goal and it's gonna help you work towards that main goal. I like to use my uh, monthly calendar as like a gratitude thing. So I write a nice thing that happened every single day. So the days look like this, they have times in them. They're straight down. I know a lot of people don't like that. Um, there's a personal to-do list, a work to-do list this week's goal focus and good things that happen this week or people you need to see that week at the end of the month it asks you a few questions on how you would change that month what you like that month and it's like just full of gratitude and growth and i just love the passion planner when you buy a passion planner from passion planner they donate a planner to a fund in need and this specific pink planner you guys know it's my favorite color it's helping the malala fund and if you don't know about the malala fund look into it that's why this one is pink and it says empowered women empower women in the back and it's super cute i will link it on amazon and the actual website down below my mom actually paid for this one but it is life-changing has changed the game i make healthy food now and i'm sure all you guys have seen people talk about air fryers but basically it just cooks your food with hot air you don't have to use oil you don't have to clean it as often. You can clean it like once a week. I push it to like two weeks sometimes, depending on how much you use it, but you don't have to clean it all the time. You just get to make healthy food without oil or like even unhealthy food, like French fries. You can make them in 15 minutes in there. The next thing I've talked about multiple times, it's reusable cotton pads 
basically they're made out of microfiber towel you wet it you can take your makeup off you could do whatever it is you do with cotton pads except use acetone and take off nail polish i wouldn't do that and then you just stick it inside this little bag kind of like a bra lingerie laundry bag and you throw it in the laundry with your clothes and it just washes out the makeup or washes out anything that you used it for and it's awesome because it eliminates you having to go to the store and buy more cotton pads over and over and over again and i hate i don't know about you but i hate cotton pads when they fall apart and then you have them stuck all over your face and in your eyes like ugh, i hated that if you want airpods but you can't afford something that's 199 dollars for your ears like earbuds i have two headphone options for you we have wireless headphones these I bought them for my mom. I will link them, obviously. Can't even read the name. Don't know how to read that name. They are really cool. Literally noise canceling. Like you, if you're wearing both of them, you won't hear anything at all. They're amazing and they were $50. She loves them. I stole her AirPods because she only has the right AirPod. The left AirPod got lost and I got a date piercing in my left ear. So it is perfect for me to wear just the right AirPod. It just made more sense. They're better and they work and she likes them and she uses them at work. And then these are my AirPods in my case that I also bought on Amazon. My AirPods, it is my one AirPod. I cannot put an earbud in this ear at all. So the other earphone option is instead of beats, I got these because again, I got a date piercing and I was supposed to wear over the ear headphones. Ended up getting these, they're rose gold. They look like beats. They sound amazing and they stay on forever. You can actually press these buttons and control what you're listening to. And they're Bluetooth. They didn't come with a case, even though it promoted that it came with a case. Very cushiony. Perfect for people with, who get headaches with headphones on. They're so cushiony. It feels like nice, like a cloud. And it did not hurt my piercing at all when I first got it. These were amazing. So this is all over TikTok now. And everyone's saying that they discovered the best thing to film tiktoks bro i bought this in 2018 when i was going to italy for study abroad it is a selfie stick that has it extends obviously it's a selfie stick but it is also a tripod so if you want to put it on a surface you can extend put it on a surface and it has a bluetooth remote i'm sure you've seen it on tiktok and everyone's claiming that they discovered it i've been having this and now that everybody's buying it it is now $30. They uppriced it. When I bought this, it was 10 bucks. So I will link it down below. It's so useful. I've had it for so many years. I used to film my YouTube videos with this when I didn't have the mount for my ring light that I just bought. So worth it if you're going on vacation. So worth it if you're trying to take your own selfies on the street. If you're trying to be a blogger and you don't have anyone to help you take pictures, this is perfect for you. A lot of YouTubers talk about this specific makeup bag but the small version, the very tiny version that's perfect for travel and perfect for your all everyday makeup. My boyfriend went ham for my birthday and he bought me the extra large size of that. And when I say extra large size, hold on. This is my makeup bag. This thing is like a suitcase, but it holds everything. I have palettes in here. I have brushes in here. I can put curl curling ones i could put anything this is perfect honestly for someone who maybe does makeup an mua who just started you can do a lot of things with this and it fits so much it is so heavy right now because i have so much in it and recently i decided that i wanted to go cruelty free but i get too much anxiety every time i look at my makeup collection to actually go through it and pick out the cruelty free items and then get rid of all the non cruelty free items that is a big step that i need to take and hopefully i will do that during this quarantine it just scares me now the next thing are the thigh high boots that i wore to the ariana grande concert picture right here they are so cute and comfy and i found them on amazon your girl has very thick legs so thigh high things just do not fit on me they do not look cute i can never find any thigh high stuff that looked like like it fit me because anything made me look like i was suffocating like i looked like a sausage just like being trapped and my fat would roll over the thigh high part and it wasn't cute it wasn't a good look so i found these on amazon extra stretchy life-changing they're beautiful i love them my most recent purchase was 
for work and then we all got sent to work from home or laid off i currently work from home i'm sorry to everyone who got laid off i'm so sorry you're going through this and i hope everything gets better i had purchased this to take to work because i was using a actual school backpack for my nine to five job um to take my laptop to and from work and i got made fun of and i got told that i look like i'm going to the first grade and then i got really embarrassed so i bought this nice work purse it looks kind of like i don't know like bougie like michael kors but it's 20 bucks it looks it's brand new it's brand spanking new it looks nice the laptop fits in it it's like fake leather it came with a mini size inside of it and a clutch inside of it in the same material so now i have a classic black purse for any occasion that's, that's pretty much it i haven't gotten to use it so i can't review it but i think it all looks so nice and that's why it's here in my favorites because i'm just excited about it this is another thing for work that i bought it is my sailor moon mouse pad from the amazon it is super dirty i did bring it from work when i got sent home wow it has a lot of makeup on it foundation but if you stand sailor moon and you want your desk to look cute amazon has a perfect like cutesy anime stuff like i always look for cute anime stuff my dog is now a senior dog and he's been acting out and peeing in places where he's not supposed to and yeah i just can't deal with cleaning the floor all the time anymore so i purchased doggy diapers and every time i mention this to somebody they get concerned about it covering his butt but since he's a male dog he doesn't have to do that these are just they cover the wee wee and that's it they go around his little waist like a little i don't know he looks like a little sumo wrestler when he's wearing these or like he's wearing a little belt and he just pees in here i'm talking about like you know when your dog like pees in a corner because he's trying to mark his territory it's like not like a fool pee we don't not take him out he does go out but if he like pees in the middle of the night it's not in the house so it goes in this diaper this one's clean and they're reusable so what i do what the instructions say is once they're like dirty you put them outside in the sun and the sun evaporates the color and like the pea smell and then once they have evaporated and it really works i've done this once it's evaporated you literally look at it and it's like it's all gone but you can still kind of smell it that's when you throw it in the washer put some bleach in there put some detergent some softener not if your dog has allergies and stuff don't put softener and then you dry it and that's it you can reuse it super simple and also on top of this sometimes he does poop in the house and we have puppy pads which are for puppies but we bought them because i don't know what's wrong with him he's acting out another thing that i bought in 2018 is this portable battery charger i bought this as an amazon deal of the day it was less than 20 bucks and let me tell you this portable charger if you charge it all night long it can charge your phone up to six times when i was in italy i didn't charge it for like a full week and i was able to charge my phone my friend's phone my other classmates um anyone who asked for my assistance basically just lights up and you can charge phones oh it's also like a flashlight i think this was made for camping the one thing with this is that if you plug it in and it's charging and then you plug something into it while it's charging it's not gonna charge the final thing on my list is my audible gaming chair i just bought this but it is pink it is me and i love it and i'm going to attach a video of it here this was 199 dollars directly from the website i think it's about 230 dollars i found this amazon seller that was selling it for 199 which is like 30 dollars off whatever but still very helpful it comes with everything it comes with a little rug it is super cute and honestly working from home it is something that i didn't know i needed i have a stool for my desk right now and i didn't realize that i needed an actual chair so i bought this also i have animal crossing now and i've been playing non-stop video games so i bought this freaking chair and yeah 
I love it. As always, everything I mentioned in this video will be linked down below. You are able to use my affiliate Amazon links below if you want to. If you don't, feel free to just search up the item. I'll put the names and the links below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not done so already. Please subscribe. Please do it. Do it. Just do it. Please be my friend. And hit the notification bell so you get notified every time I post a new video. I hope you guys are staying safe and stay beautiful. I love you. Peace. She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something about her features You'll find the beauty goes much deeper